yes yes hello everyone welcome back again to this tutorial in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to convert text in column in microsoft office excel as you can see here i have my text here which is made up of uh 10 names of 10 different people so they are the first name and the second one as you can see if I have the first name and last name should be written uh, maybe in different columns that is what I want what I need to do I need to come here and select these names that I have after selecting the names I come here to data as you can see in Microsoft Office Excel after opening data I have to click on it right you can see now I have text into column in your Excel. You, you will see text into column section. After clicking on text into column section, I want to be seeing this option. You can see now that my text is selected. Now I have to remain this. Uh, you can see characters such as commas or tabs separated. You can be, I choose this delimited. You can see if we're going to be seeing this one. After that, I have to come here and click next. After clicking next, you can see I have a text. You can see I have a two columns. What I need to do, for instance, if I deselect this one, you can see I'm going to be uh, still having uh, my first name and last names. However, if you want to be separating, for instance, like using tabs, you can use comma. If you want to use comma, you can use them. So if you want to be using uh, this one, semicolon it's up to you but you need to be choosing space if you choose space you want to be separating your names into uh, into two columns that means i want to be having two columns after this i have to click next you can see this is a preview of my column then i click finish as you can see now i have two columns which include the first name this first name and the last name so which means now i, I can be able to use these two columns in my excel Thank you for watching this tutorial. Remember to subscribe to this channel CV, like this video, share it with your friends. If you have any questions or suggestions, remember to leave it in the comment section.